Good morning. Um, so we are like day two of um, quarantine. Are we being quarantined? We're not really being quarantined. But so no, let's not do that. Let's say because we're not we're not sick or anything. Uh, I think you save that for people who are sick. Uh, we are um, social distancing, but not social media distancing. <laughs> you can continue uh, <coughs> getting on social media, but I don't want to be near you. If I can smell you, you're too close. <laughs> okay, so my daughter's going to do makeup next to me. I'm going to show you my daughter. So she's going to be doing makeup next to me so she can walk me through some of my mistakes I make. Okay. She thought she <laughs> she thought my eyebrows were too dark yesterday. No, they were patchy, not too dark. My eyebrows? Yeah, because some parts were dark and then some parts weren't, so it looked strange. Well, that's because I don't have any structure on my eyebrows. In fact, sometimes it looks like I have two separate eyes, and I'm going to explain. I'm quite aware that this eye... No, this eye. Yeah, you can t look, babe. Look in the mirror. I mean, look in the phone. Yeah, I have this the same thing. eye has a bigger hood than that eye. Did she know I just noticed this? I'm a discoloring mess. As you can see, this is a problem of women over thirty. Um. I mean, uh, the option of going without makeup has left the building at this age. <clears throat> and believe me, I spent all my 20s and 30s not wearing foundation. I, I'm not exaggerating. I, um, as a stay-at-home mom, and then um, I went to college late in life, and <clears throat> there's no way I was going to wear makeup. And I didn't even wear makeup when I got when I got my substitute teaching job uh, that's what I did when I was um, going through college I was a, a substitute teaching and I didn't wear makeup I didn't and um, I'm surprised <laughs> that the children didn't run away in fear uh, maybe that's why they were so afraid of me <laughs> but um, I remember getting a long-term sub job, um, and I remember thinking I should put a little bit of makeup on, and so I would, um, I, I started buying some cheap stuff, uh, the Dollar Tree, um, because that's really all I could afford. Now, I, um, I just feel like, um... As soon as I hit 40, everything changed. And um, I don't have um, rosacea. I just was at the doctor's yesterday. And she doesn't think she um, is putting me on a once a week pill, this like power vitamin D pill um, to get my levels back up. And she said that should help with some of your skin issues like eczema, um, psoriasis. I have psoriasis in the weirdest places. I have it in my ears and yeah, I have it in my ears. I have it. Well, now the common places in the back of your hair and, um, just weird places. And I'm thinking, what is that about? Um, so anyway, she's going to, so I'm on vitamin D and we'll see how that works. Speaking of vitamins, I'm going to start with vitamin C. Now I took off my claws. I do my own nails. I do not get them done professionally. I went to Amazon and I bought a thousand nails, 500 coffin, 500 square tip, and both sets are long. I do my own nails. I paint them. I, um, I do my own artwork if I do do artwork. But with all the hand washing I'm doing, <laughs> they started popping off. So I thought, I'm just going to. So last night, while we were watching Jumanji, I 
pull them all off. And um, so I'm back to my little stubs. And um, that's okay because uh, I don't have to go back to work till the 23rd. So, anyway. Okay. Do you have any powder? Yes, I do. Right, in here. In there. Okay, so first thing I start off with is my vitamin C. My face is already clean. So yesterday I told you that we start, or my la my first video, my first Avon video, I told you clean with this. So I clean with this at all times. Um, I'm gonna start with some vitamin C, a little, I mean that little goes a long way. And then you rub it in. They have of the same vitamin C line, they have a lip moisturizer. Oh my gosh, I, I think I'm gonna try it. You have to understand that my Avon sales will support my Avon habit. <laughs> So I cannot buy anything till you buy stuff. Is <laughs> your promo? Yeah, that's my promo. I told Barry uh, just no, not even yesterday, just a while ago. I said I want this palette. It was it's that mega palette. I didn't know they were still selling it, and I said, "Can I have it? Can I have it? Can I have it?" So I am not going in the right direction selling Avon. <laughs> my my sales cannot outnumber my customers. What? Where's your Morphe palette? Oh, yeah. right here. Yeah, I think I'm going to do Stormy today. Stormy? Yeah, I'm a grown woman who uses makeup. Well, I mean, I think it's good that you're using her power. Yeah, I do want to try Jeffree Star. He has better makeup. I, yeah, my daughter says that Jeffree Star has better makeup, but I, I like her stuff. I love her. I love to follow that. Okay, next up, Power Serum from the Anu collection okay so on my first video i accidentally said brief that the new moisturizer that you guys will be getting you everyone who places an order we're are going to get six free samples that is an that's the avon um campaign right now six free samples of this new moisturizer new to avon called belief and it's not spelled uh, correctly. It's B-E-L-I-F. And yesterday I misspoke and I said brief. And if you click the link to my store, it'll take you right to uh, my page. And the first page will say up right on the top of the banner, right above where it says Lisette's Avon store, will tell you you're going to get six free samples of Believe. So if you ordered for me, I don't know if you saw that, you're going to get um, some free samples of that. If you are seeing this video, you're on my Facebook page. And if you look at today's specials, I posted where you can buy, it's in a lip container, um, for $30, all of the Avon colors and little travel size, li li little samples. <gasps> but see, before I buy that, I want, I want to know why I can't get them cheaper than that. Okay, I'm going to, guess what I have to show y'all today? My Avon lipstick collection. I do have them. And I'm going to re-smell them and re-taste them uh, okay. <laughs> because that's my belief, is that do not put lipstick that makes you not touch your lips. I have had lipstick where I talk like this because I don't want to taste that. And that's not good lipstick. And um, can I go ahead and say that Revlon has the nastiest lipstick on this planet? Go ahead and say it. <laughs> it, does, it just, it tastes like, oh, it just tastes horrible. Um, do you remember those Coca-Cola bottles that you used to bite off the waxes and then you'd suck out the Coke? That's what they taste like. Okay, I got my moisturizer done. I'm gonna do my eyes and I'm gonna do Stormy. And this is gonna be a quick video. Um, this is not a quick video. It's already 14 minutes, Mom. <laughs> See, I'm one of those people that uh, my husband knows. I'm going to go in real quick. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go get something real quick. And I'm, I'm just going to talk to them real quick. 13 hours later. I'm not. So I am charging my mirror. 
and it is uh, taking forever. Okay, I didn't do the eye um, lift today because I did it yesterday. So I don't need to do eye lift two days in a row. I do want to um, buy that Belief Hydra Moisture stuff because that is what I want to use as my morning moisture. We're pretty cool around here. It's very humid and I don't have a problem with dehydration. I don't have a problem with dry skin. And I, in fact, I'm always look sweaty, you know, I always look sweaty, so uh, I don't, I can back off on the, the moisturizer, you know? Well, you, is your skin greasy? No. Okay, you're just sweaty? Yeah. Okay, because if it was greasy, that means your skin is overcome. And my classroom is, I'm sorry, my classroom is sweaty. Do you have hot classes? No. I love your makeup. Okay, so what I did is, I put. Honestly, I could do my makeup every day and it would look great, but I'm just like way too lazy at this point of the year. If you're interested in, in, in um, Kylie Jenner's makeup, I'm using her Angel on Earth. Oh, I think I want to be silly and use some gold. For what? For my look today. Yeah, but where? On my eyelid. How, Mom? Like a cut crease, like in the center, in your... Like cut a... crease or in the center. I don't know these terms. <laughs> okay. okay, so like, you know your Okay, lid. so here, let me point out. <laughs> so I put this angel on earth on my whole lid. My whole, it's like I have a whole... What's the angel on earth one? This orange one. Okay. Be careful, it's very patchy. And since it's a pale color, it's going to show it. Okay. It is patchy. Oh yeah, let's just talk about that. It's patchy. It is a little patchy. Not a little, a lot. Of okay, things. Sam hates uh, uh, this I collection. I hate the palette. I do love the color. Yeah, you can have a bowl. It's just. Um, and then. Oh, you know I love purple. Lavender. That's a lavender, or the grape one. Oh, you call that grape? That's grape. That's lavender. Okay, then I'll do. Uh, I want to incorporate some lavender and some gold. Yeah, that's Let's good. do it. Okay. I don't know how you're going to incorporate the orange because I did that look, but it just looks strange. Well, it's on. It's there. It's happening. It's happened. Okay, Mom. Okay. Um, I'm going in. It's called Stormy Weather. Is that not the cutest thing? Because that's her daughter. Honestly, I was surprised. I thought they were all just rumors that she Like, no nothing's, like, nothing's coming up. What do you mean? Which color? Stormy weather. Oh, shit. <laughs> Mom. There it is. <laughs> also, you're supposed to use a flat, wet brush. Oh, I am? Yeah, because fluffy brushes, they give all fallout, so it goes under your eyes instead of actually on your lips. Is that a flat? Too. That's a flat brush. But I use wet this for it other things. Well, for what? Um, I think I use this to wipe up mascara. You're supposed to use a Q-tip with makeup remover. <laughs> She's teaching me, guys. I actually use this when I get mascara marks. I use this, I go in there, and I take it off. Like, I get that. That's smart. Well, but I just loaded this up with way. gold. Can I not use this? You can. With the we'll fallout. We'll see how it goes. There's a lot of fallout. Okay, let's see this. Uh, I, you know, I thought I invented that back in the late 80s. Invented what? I used to buy makeup, okay? Uh huh. And I used to wet the brush and apply makeup on to make it stay longer. Well. And I actually think that's a Mary Kay tip. That's a Mary Kay tip. Well, now it's like a more mainstream. Yeah. Wet your brush for the glitters. In fact, I want to say you were supposed to wear uh, Mary Kay's makeup wet. That's back in the day. Back in the day. Anybody remember that? Oh, you said back in the day? Oh, this is my day. 
class started two hours ago. Oh, oh wow. Way, this is a... Uh... I already graduated, but you can live through anything if magic made it. Oh, that's... Kanye West. That's ridiculous, but I'm going to go with it. So, change of plans. Now. <laughs> My eyebrow shape is so nice. Like, naturally, I'm just following my regular no. eyebrow hair. Um, but they just have no pigment. They just decide. I, I literally have two separate eyes because, oh, my gosh. I mean, I have a big eye here. And then... Didn't we already talk about these? Sam, kidding. look at this. And, and look at this. Yeah, I know, Mom. My eyebrows are thin. <laughs> Wait, do we well, have a my leveler? My eyes are the same. My eyes are thin right here, and my this eye is bigger. Look, look at this. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah, I know. How do I have a lower eyebrow? Now look. Oh my God. I'm not symmetrical. <laughs> that is so That's embarrassing. Mom, you know, you know, Gigi Hadid and Bella Hadid? Yeah. Uh, there's videos that I've been watching and they've just had plastic surgery. I thought they were naturally like that, but no. They were all jacked up. <laughs> no, they weren't jacked up. They were beautiful before and still now. It's just like they fixed their noses to be more symmetrical and they got Botox and eyelids. Okay, that's, to look, oh, yeah. All those more. girls. All those it's girls. It's kind of annoying. Um, not happening with me. I, that's not... I mean, I always tease my husband that when I'm 50, I'm going to get a breast reduction. Why don't um, you, Mom? Your little back. Because, yeah, my little back. Um, and go from whatever this size is. I'm not going to... Hush. <laughs> She's going to be outing me on my e size. You know. I don't even know your bra size. I'm size. E <laughs> <laughs> and uh, reduce me down to a C. That would, you would literally, as soon as you like stood up, you would fall backwards. <laughs> you wouldn't be prepared for it. But now I'm thinking I should have a surgery on making my face symmetrical. Look at that. Is that the, the funniest thing? I am mom, crooked. I'm the same thing. I'm crooked too. No, you're too. not. You're very yes, symmetrical. I no, I'm not, mom. You this are. eye's bigger than this eye. I I never noticed this my whole life. Also, my lips are. This must have happened after I turned forty. My face must have fought. What if I have like some kind of disease and didn't know about it? You're having a long stroke. Like I don't know. <laughs> the world's longest stroke. Yeah, mom. Don't you're joke about. Fine. Don't joke about stroke. You're fine, mom. Like don't even. Worry I look like it. a showgirl. Look at this makeup. <laughs> this for what event what I, <laughs> I actually really like it i'm liking it you know what uh i love when you uh like my makeup and my my students they get a kick out on my makeup because they don't know what to say and i don't think that they're being uh i no i i will never that why am i blending with that um you, you good well, I kind of keep my neutrals here, and I can't find my... Well, I'm using your Morphe palette, being known for that. Because okay. my palettes are old. This is like... the Yeah, my palettes are kind of old. Um, and they will... They're genuine. They're genuinely kind, and they will look at me, and they will say, um... Uh, Mrs. Thomas, um, you, um you gave me a zero and I know I turned that paper in and I'm like, okay, just look at my basket. Maybe it's there with no name. And then she's like, okay. And I really like your eye makeup. <laughs> that happened? Yes. Um, just like, that's so sweet. And my nails, I get compliments on my nails. And, um, I mean, I got compliments on nothing anymore. You can represent your personality. Because, see, I wear a school uniform. And I'm not talking about polos and slacks. I have 10 outfits that I would never wear out in public. Not because they're hideous. Just that they are my, they're my uniform. That These are outfits I wear for school. Um, and my outfits that I wear for home, I mean, uh, to go out... Um, uh, show a little bit more of my decolletage. Here you go. It's a decolletage. Oh. Breasticles. The <laughs> your cleavage. Um, and they are cut different. Like, I have a bunch of Kiona shirts. Kiona. 
K-I-Y-O-N-N-A. Go there. That, I'll link it to okay, I'll link it. I'll link it in the description. I love Kiona tops, and I bought some a couple years ago. And even though I've gained a lot of weight, they still fit. They still look good on me. And I like wearing them when I go out. I also wear jeggings. I don't wear jeggings to work. Um, I wear, I love jeggings. That's my, I mean, I you remember the mom from that TV show, the Disney mom from Wizards of Waverly yes. Place? Did I not dress like her Literally. when you were growing up? What? Teresa, Miss Teresa. I thought y'all were the same woman because both brown. So we, I dress like that with the, now the only thing I never wore are heels. I don't wear heels. You used to and then you messed up your entire face. Yeah, I got um, plantar fasciitis. And does this look blended? If I had a dollar for everything, does this look blended? Um, not really. Um, the grape color needs to be more blended, more on the this eye, like more inwards. More inwards, okay. Yeah. And oh, that's working. I just gotta be patient. I get impatient. I want things quick. Wait, should I match your look, but just do it better? <laughs> sure. We're wearing a lavender sure. Sure. We're both wearing pink. Okay, do it. I, I, we're the grape, which is not grape. It's called um, that color is called Love Without Limits. And then I have this on the lid, and that's stormy weather. You know what you should do every time you start a look. Since the Morphe palette is just so nice and consistent, I love you get this. this color and cover your entire lid. You didn't do I, it, but I told you to do it. Yesterday last I used that. Will you be surprised? No, I mean like to cover your entire um. lid. Uh, okay, so in my process of blending, where did all this eyeshadow come from? I mean, uh, it's fluffing out of your brush. Oh. Uh, it seems like a lot. This might be too much. Slow and steady wins the race. So now that I know that I have a crooked face and my eyes are not um, even, they're not symmetrical at all, um, it's kind of sad. I don't think there's anything more I should do with my face. Just, um, I'm gonna pull in this. Good thing I don't have the camera on me because I make the ugliest faces when I put on. I don't. Photo. I don't make faces. Yeah. I make faces when I put on. Um... <clears throat> hey, don't you think I should wear um, eyeliner with this look? <gasps> I'm gonna wear eyeliner. Yeah, I think I should wear eyeliner with this look. Nice. Oh my gosh. And I'm it's, not I'm not going to do anything with my brows but comb them. It's the one that you got me. This one. I don't know what it's called. Chella. Literally it's the best eyeliner ever. Mm. It's a marker, not an eyeliner. So. You know, I could trick my face into being symmetrical by contouring. No. By No, I can't trick it. I have never noticed this about me. True story. I went to the doctors with my husband to get his eyes checked. And the doctor looked at him and gave him, you know, uh, you know, he had his appointment, what have you. And the doctor was in a chair, you know, those little wheelie chairs. And he whipped around and he looked at me and he says, you, young lady, have sleep apnea. And I said... Yeah, I think I do. I always feel like I'm choking in the middle of the night. And uh, I said, how did you know that? He says, I can tell by your eyes. Can you look at my eyes? Because I do be choking over nothing. Like when I'm going to sleep. Mm. It's so annoying. So if I lay down a certain way, I can't breathe. You know, I don't snore. But I, I do choke sometimes. And that's a horrible thing to say, right? Um. Okay, I'm done with my eyes, and I'm gonna put some eyeliner. Let's go. Let's try this. Okay. 
Now, time to cut my grease. If they would sell more liquid liner in every color imaginable, you know that's what I would be buying. And they, they do. do. But you know what people do? They just use lipstick. They buy extra lipsticks and they get a line brush and they just put it on and they get matte lipsticks and it stays. Did y'all hear that tip from the teenager? Mom. Girls are buying matte lipstick. And well, not everyone, Mom. This is just me because I'm innovative and I also have like bolder looks than most people. I know. Oh. oh, I like the glitter you used for highlight. Oh, wait, no, that's just the fallout. Huh. <laughs> I don't highlight. Why not? That's mom? fallout. That's what my daughter Why calls. Fallout, mom? Hey, mom, I'm, uh, I'm bouncing. Okay, like your friends here. Tell yeah. curly haired Sam I said hi. Oh, I brought my wallet. Put it on eyeliner, hold on. Um, oh, shoot. There is a palette that's going to be available. Okay, so if I'm understanding correctly, when I first signed up, this palette was available only, I think, I think that's what I'm understanding early on campaign six so i thought that's it it's available but no they stopped yeah yeah okay and then it came back now now I, if i'm understanding it's uh, there it's back ordered and it'll be available campaign nine and this palette is so gorgeous i want it so bad I'm done with that. And I have fallout. So I'm just gonna. Is it this gold? Yeah. Okay. Take this. Get that off. Mom, maybe I should make a video because I'm This really is, good it's like it. sucking the power out. Doesn't like, it doesn't feel like it's giving me any power. Am I in? Does this thing even work? Yeah, it does. No, the outlet. Oh. Put it on the bottom one to see, because it wasn't doing that. We live like in a thousand year old house. 60. No, it's. Yeah. Not a thousand, huh? No idea. Um, and our outlets are so old. Ugh. Oh, this is not pigmented. It's so just like. I have it plugged in. Okay, so, <clears throat> um, let's get some mascara on. Oh my god. Remember, I like mascara that stays wet. No, you need waterproof. Longer before it sets. If it sets too fast, that's why you have clumpy eyelashes because it's set way too fast and you put wet, you, you went through your second um, application on dried mascara and that's where you're getting the clumpy look. This doesn't set fast and, um, and this is um, Essence Lash Princess and it doesn't set fast. Now, I said I didn't like Avon mascara because I, when I got my kit, I was given two of them and then I bought one. So I thought out of these three mascaras, I don't like them. Well, they have a new mascara. And again, you don't like it? I will post. No, I haven't even bought it. I haven't even tried it. So uh, don't count Avon out on mascara yet. You know the Better Than Sex Mascara? No. It's like really, it's honestly the best mascara I've used. My friend let me borrow it. Probably shouldn't have borrowed it, but I did. Yeah, and that's how the coronavirus spreads, guys. Your eye, no, Mom, no. Oh, I just poked my eye. 
Look at it, Mom. Hold on. Oh, you look pretty. Just like that good. I'm just kidding. You know. And I got mascara on my nose. Tip: Use an eyeshadow palette literally for everything. I just don't know how many times. Is that that thing that you stick under your eye? They sell adhesives that you can put under your eye. What, what thing? What she just said, a shadow palette. Eyeshadow palette, Mom. Oh, I'm, I didn't understand what you meant. Okay, and now for my... If you are a woman over 40, you should be... You should have some kind of moisturizer mixed in with your, your um, makeup. You should have some SPF inside your makeup. And... <clears throat> Oh, you know why I can't show you a picture of the new um, cream to powder foundation that was supposed to rival this stuff? They don't make it anymore. So I'm pretty sure it got bad reviews. Um, and they just stopped making it. They don't make it anymore. So I can't even give you a link to it so you can try it for yourself. It's gone. Now it's a bunch of liquid. Sam, you tried the Magix toner. What? The little black tube that y'all were playing. Y'all, the primer, not toner. I'm sorry, primer. The Magix, M-A-G-I-X. You remember that? Kind of. Oh, it was the tube? Yes. And, oh, yeah. They loved it. No, I didn't. Oh, you didn't it like did it? It did nothing. It made my face greasy, and it was just, like, not spreadable. She it didn't like, like it. It was like paper towels in a cream form. She said paper towels in a cream form. That just, that's the only way it makes sense for me to explain it. It was just a I, great product. Okay, Katie and I, and you have to admit Katie liked it too, correct? Yeah, but Katie, you and Katie kind of have a weird skewed sense of good makeup. We liked it. We liked it so much probably because it helped with our skin discoloration. You, We could wear it. Um... And then that was it. I, I wore that all summer. I didn't wear makeup. I just put on the, the Magix um, primer. Oh, That's what I did. So I'm going to use this. Okay, so mom. Uh -huh. do, you, uh, do you wear foundation and ever think, oh, this looks discolored. You could tell where I'm darker and I'm lighter. What's your question? Do you ever put on foundation and think... I, it, my skin looks different colors around my entire face. Okay, so, yes, because right now. I just needed the yes or no, okay? Yeah, this is how I test it if my color is the right color. By my forehead, which has less blemishes. So, this matches my forehead. You see that? Uh -huh. And so, I know I have the right color. When my forehead starts getting dark. Um, because summer's coming around, then I then I go and buy a darker color. So this one is natural beige. I think the next one is natural buff. Um, that that's, that's how I choose my color. Now I know some girls are getting into mixing colors, but you can't really do that when you're buying these these types of makeups. Um, I guess if you had liquid, and you can mix the liquids. To find your perfect color some girls go through all that trouble to do that um i'm old school and you your skin color becomes the color that's in the bottle that sounds horrible but that's just the way it is and like i said the color that i'm trying to match is the uh, the color i mean i don't know why people try to match their arm that doesn't even make that's sense not the same color. that is not i match my forehead People say like, I have no makeup on my forehead right now. So, if your makeup is blending well with your forehead, I mean, I barely, I very lightly, that's it, I'm done. Um, this is, you know, I got to get all this to the same color as my forehead. Then you have managed to find the color of your face. Is your forehead not a part of your face? Yes, it is. So I'm not gonna swatch. I'm not gonna swatch foundations on my arm or my hand. I'm gonna swatch them here and then see if they match my forehead. That is. Have you ever heard of that, Sam? Or did you just learn something new from me? No, I've heard of that. People say you're supposed to use your neck or your forehead. Really? So I am not original. No. What the thing is for people who are like some people. 
they're very patchy because of acne scars you're supposed to use green like a cream green cream over the patchy stuff and every basically your entire face and it gives you a blank canvas and then you put on the foundation and everything matches okay i've seen that green stuff i don't know if i'm committed to that well since you do your foundation so much i don't think i mean so quickly I do I do it quickly. Like I don't do highlighters and I don't do contouring because what are you contouring? You don't contour an egg. Um, <laughs> well, I have a round face. What are we contouring? Your cheekbones. My smile contours my cheekbones. And if I'm not smiling, then I have to figure out what's going on in my life. Okay. get in there with my very cheap blush well, first oh i forgot to um post uh um if you've seen this video you're obviously on my facebook account and in the comments i'm going to post the blush stick please oh, purchase something blush. so i can buy that blush stick <laughs> Mom, oh my gosh. That is, what am I doing? What am I selling Avon? Because I'm, I'm, I'm an ambassador for Avon. One, I love their skincare products. I want to buy their stuff, so I'm going to sell their stuff. Well, That's a good idea. I'm not one of those like, makeup artists who lies that they like the stuff. And, and they don't? They don't. Oh, no. Oh, money is too precious for me. I'm not gonna. Well, they don't buy it. They get it for free in PR. No, no, but I'm not gonna. I mean, money is so precious to me. I, I know. I assume it's precious to everybody. I, except right now, toilet paper seems to be the commodity. Right? Everybody's getting toilet paper. Stop buying toilet paper. My poor baby sister called me looking for toilet paper. My sister and my mom have no toilet paper. I told them to come by the house, pick up some toilet paper. Shame on people going berserk. Why? It's just toilet paper. I don't understand. See, the you know Bear wants a a uh, a uh, um a duvet. I'm actually probably gonna let him get one. You want to do a uh, uh, what did I say? A duvet? Not a duvet. Uh, a bidet. I was about to say I a, a bidet. <laughs> I have a duvet. You need a blanket. <laughs> Oh, Lord. And the next is lipstick. Okay. Because I'm going to... Where is my... Okay. This is just to soften my oh lips. My God, this is it's bliss tech. Okay. Let's go over these lipsticks. I have any glasses. This is like your my my daughter gave me this. My oldest daughter gave me this and I'm having some issues with it. Okay. This is Like, I really can't read this. I'm what? really blind. Do you have a flashlight on that? No, the it got ran over. I cannot see this. Let me see. What does it even say? So, some lipsticks have this silver band. Lipstick and some have bland, the black. And I want to say... Yeah, I can't read that. The mattes. I'm not going to tell you the wrong thing. There's a, there's a, there's why there's this distinction. And so this one is nourishing lipstick. And the color is, this can't be real. I mean, like. I cannot read this to save my life. Okay, I'm going to read it. Okay, so. I'm really blind. <laughs> okay, so this 
it's called if you can see that isn't that beautiful peony am i saying that right the, the it's called peony blush adoring you can even see my smudge marks adoring adoring love this is a matte which i look horrible in called yeah. perfectly nude i i just i don't do good with nudes, nudes i look good with bright pinks unless they directly match your and then of course you can see this is i love this this is very adventurous of me to wear this wear um shirt? cherry jubilee i wore it i wore it to school one time um just wore the lipstick and i swear i got so many not even compliments really i got like oh. why are you all no why are you all dressed up that's what i got what's the occasion so i must have looked like harlot i don't know <laughs> this was maybe too dark for me the town tart and then this is ideal lilac let me show you this now this i love I'm going to put it on. Oh, no. Where's my brush? Just had it. Uh. Bro. Oh, there you are. I don't know. You're not vibing with it today. Ew. I don't like that at all. Let me see. Oh, yeah. It looks too Barbie. Yeah, it looks too Barbie. That's coming off. No, I don't. I just don't do lipsticks very much. I do um, my lip glosses. And Avon has some beautiful lip glosses coming out. And I want this purple one. I'm going to try this so you can see how drastic this looks. Oh my God, that's Let's do that last. Good. Let's try this. This is the Adoring Love. I might like this one. Uh, I'm trying this on for you guys, but in reality, I'm not a lipstick girl. I'm a lip gloss girl. Just such a weird thing for a 40 something to say. I know. 40, she's saying that's a weird thing. You have to speak louder. She's saying that's a weird thing for a 40-something-year-old to say. I have to focus to get this eyeliner even. I know that if my oldest was here, she would love this color on me. Let me see. Oh, it looks great on you. Really? Yeah, just different eye look. Because your lips are huge, Mom. They are huge. They don't look huge, but they are when you put lipstick on them. That's what happens to me. I put on lipstick and everyone... I always like, like a lip color that makes my my teeth look white. Can I borrow that? Yes, you may. She's going to try the peony. Am I saying that right? Peony. Peony. She says it so much better. I said peony. I'm like so, I'm so, uh, sounding it out phonetically. Peony. See, the trick is... Mom. Okay, but now here's the thing about lipstick. I love it. Um, I know y'all are thinking that's weird. What? That's all you need. You mm. put on a whole... That's not... Yeah, but I have big lips. So do I, Mom. Well, like... Big okay, so I tasted girl. it. <laughs> and it doesn't... It doesn't, doesn't... It doesn't have a taste... Really doesn't even taste at all. And that is what you want. And there's some lipsticks out there that just have nasty... Really? Kylie? Everyone? You know Kylie? Personally, no. <laughs> I'm talking about, like... Her lip glosses and lipsticks, everyone's like, they taste good and they have like a nice smell, but that's not what I'm here for. Well, that's what I'm here for. <laughs> Just like they aren't good. Should I take this off and then try it? Yeah, let me do that. I'm going to take this off now. You know how I learned how to say peony? Let me, um, okay, I'm going to take this off. Took some pictures. Uh, 
Okay. Now we're gonna go into Cherry Jubilee. This is what I wore and everyone asked me where I was going. <laughs> oh, I don't know, I don't know what that means. Okay. Oh my God, the moisture in this lipstick. The moisturizers that are in this lipstick. <gasps> ah. Now I remember why I wear it. I may not have been too crazy with the color. It just feels so luxurious. It's just way too dark for me. Cause you can see my inner lip and that's not what I want. Oh my gosh. Okay, the color, <laughs> it's not my color. But it feels amazing, this lipstick. There's gotta be a reason why. No, it's not one of the nurt the nourishing ones. It's just lipstick, cherry jubilee. That's it. And see, one of these is called nourishing. And this is a regular lipstick. <clears throat> That's a matte. So this one, this is a nourishing lipstick. I think the ones with this this uh, silver band, I just figured it out. These are the nourishing ones. And this is a nourishing one, but it uh, doesn't say so on the bottom. But this one does. So I think that these are part of the um, nourishing line. Um, and I will I'll find these and post them. I'm not a fan of the color. It's just, you see how it's just too much. That's just too much. I mean, that's. I'd oh have to. God. I'd have to live. I off. haven't looked at you in a while. That's that's very bold. It's very bold. <laughs> it's bold. I had to live a whole other life to wear this kind of lipstick. Hey, I'm done with my eyeliner. Time. I don't even think I would wear this out, to be honest. I like how I do my makeup super slow, and you're just like, oh, lipstick time. I wanted to be one of those women that could wear red. And just like, you know, you, you read Cosmopolitan, don't get sucked into those things, but you read Cosmopolitan and they say, you should have a black dress and you should have a red lipstick. Find your signature red. I look horrible in all red. I look horrible in red. I can only do pinks and purples with a base color in it. Just look at this, look at this. I mean, I love it. Cherry Jubilee, it's pretty. And it feels great. But I look ridiculous. Take it off. So I do good with mobs. That's just ridiculous. Uh, I did good with... Fuchsia, that kind of thing. Um, where's my lip color? Where's my little cheapy? Oh, there it is. Okay. I'm just going to wear my cheapy mauve. And there is some discoloration. Oops, sorry about that. Some discoloration in my lips. What is that saying that Clark Gable says to Scarlett O'Hara, you should be kissed and often. Uh, that's what my lips look like right now. Like they've been kissed. With the corona, nothing. 
Did you know that people are advising to not kiss strangers? <laughs> Sam just said, say that again. People are being advised not to kiss strangers like it wasn't common sense before. <laughs> but like one night stands, I suppose. Oh, Lord. You know, the, the, the cherry jubilee is popping out of my lips. Because my mom doesn't normally look like that. Maybe you should mix. I just like when my lips glide. Okay. Well, that's my look for today. Wait, let me finish mine. Keep talking. Mm. And I'm going to fix my hair. I'm almost done with my mascara so they can see how great I look. You can follow me on Instagram. Instagram, I talk about Avon. And I also talk about... God, I have just curls all over the place. I talk about hair toppers. So, on my Instagram, it's all about my um, experience with... Um, uh, I, don't, I don't talk a lot about hair toppers because I just got one. Um, but... Um, <clears throat> this spring and summer, I plan to experiment with hair toppers and wigs. Now, I cannot wear anything. I've said I say this all the time. I cannot wear anything new um, this school year because I cannot be a distraction, and I will be a distraction if I show up to school with a bunch of sixteen and seventeen year olds. Not wearing a wig, a wig because they will spot me i mean they notice everything and they will notice this woman has more hair <laughs> so i will play with wigs and toppers and um so on my instagram i talk i want that to be my format where i talk about my avon and my hair toppers but if you're seeing this video, you're seeing it on my Facebook page. Um, my, ex, you know, that's exclusively for my Avon group, so that you don't have to be bombarded with um, Avon sales unless you go to the group or you know it, you just see it. But you don't have to participate in it. And um, that's that. So, I'm done. Thank you for watching. Y'all want to see Sam's look? Oh, yeah, y'all do. Come here, babe. Okay. You're so white and pretty. <laughs> That's racist, mother. <laughs> what, baby? What's the big box about? I don't know. That just came in. Who is this for? We're Mark? cute. Okay. We're going to take some pictures. And um, please shop. Click the link to go to my shop and um, subscribe um, over the year. Apparently, I got 11,000 views. That just hurts. I don't think you can do that. What do you mean? It, for some reason, it records sideways. I'm really sorry about that. Wow. <laughs> but come here. I got 11,000 views for a tamale instant pot video. <laughs> so here we are doing makeup. <laughs> And I thought, 11,000, what the heck? And so I became a verified YouTube user. <laughs> and now I'm like, oh, okay, I have subscribers. Who are, you? Who are these 19 people? Thank you. Um, but, um, so anyway, uh, it's just going to be recipes. Uh, that's my YouTube account. Recipes. YouTube and Instagram are pretty identical. It, um, family recipes, my hair topper, and... Yeah. Makeup. Topper, yeah. Personality. Yeah. All my hair toppers. And, um, so, uh, go to my store and support my makeup habit. Okay. I can't be, buy makeup unless you do. That's just how it works. Mom can't review it unless And I can't review it. it unless I buy it. Okay. So, I, uh, uh, don't forget, you're going to get six free samples of belief moisturizer uh, for every purchase that you make. Um, I don't know if it's over a certain amount. I don't think it is. I think it's just anybody who makes the purchase anything it's going to get those samples. I think, I think, I think. Um, so um, I will post that in the comments um, below. I'll get good at this where I know these stuff at the top of my head right now. I'm just, I will 
um, put a disclaimer as far as I know. And if I'm saying anything correctly, I will make corrections. And so, um, don't forget about my new uh, Ultimate Kit. It's like on sale for like $50, $56, originally 130 or something like that. And, um, and you're, and you're going to get the free cleanser with it. And then you're going to get some um, belief samples with your order. And um, have fun, be safe, and wash your hands.